Okay, I have a little treat for you today. I uh, recently wrote a book called Personal Archetypes for Stress Relief, A Holistic Guide. It, right now it's available on Amazon as a pre-order and it will be published November 16th. The book is, uh, you don't need cards with the book, but I did do a deck uh, the images, there's 52 images in the book of the archetypes. And uh, I'll also be offering cards, but I won't be selling them myself. I put them on a shop on uh, Make Playing Cards, and I'll put a link in uh, the, description, the description below about the cards. Um, so you don't really need the cards for the book. The book has all the illustrations and all the, all the information you need on the archetypes, but it, it's nice to have a deck, especially if you work with cards. So I, I wanted to do, um, a deck well for myself. And then I thought, well, if anyone's interested, they can, uh, purchase them at Make Playing Cards. As I said, I'll put the, well, I'll put the link below when I have it. Uh, right now you'll be seeing the cards. The, um, I did check there, now it's third party and it's print on demand, so any issues you have with the deck, you have to contact them directly. I have no uh, involvement with making the cards or mailing the cards out or anything like that. So, uh, but I did look at their policies and they seem very willing to, you know, especially if there's a problem with the printing or you don't get the card you're supposed to, you, know, you should always check those. Now, this is gonna be, this is a, um, it's a, poker deck. I like smaller decks. It's a poker deck made with poker cards, but I, I did all the images. The, uh, the book, the images that I, that are in, on the cards are, uh, generated from, uh, Dolly or ChatGPT. So the 52, uh, images that I have, uh, I did generate them th with artificial intelligence with AI. And, um, I, you give them prompts, you give the, uh, it, the AI prompts. So I would talk about what, I, w I devised all the, the archetypes and then I would say what the archetype was about, what I, what I, I thought it was for, what I, I, my meaning for the archetype. And then I also did author notes. So I, w I was feeding a lot of information and they came up with these cards after I gave them information. So it was kind of a, I would say, um, collaborative, to say the least. So we're gonna go through the prep cards really quickly. Uh, just, I want you to show, show you what they are to get a good handle on, uh, if you are interested in buying them, what you'll be getting. So there's 52 cards and uh, each card has the title on it and the number. The number is, is the table of contents. So you'll find it as number one in the table of contents. They're also done alphabetically. So you can um, look at them, you know, from the out, if it's an A, it's in the beginning of the contents or whatever. So that can, uh, you can then find them easily in the book. So we're just gonna go through, through them pretty fast and uh, I'll leave a link below when, I, when they're available on Make Playing Cards. Okay, let's get started. Uh, the first one is Ancestral Guardian. The second archetype is Angel. I'm gonna have to get these, they're too slippery. Um, animal Spirits. Anxious Worrier. Body Whisperer. Boundary Setter. Centering Flow. Collector. If you've read, if anyone's read uh, Quigley Tree, um, this one will, you'll have a better understanding of what this is. Companion. Cycle of life.
darkness. Decoder. As I said, in the book, you'll, you'll find out what all these things, all these cards mean. And they have uh, the, the cards themselves, the, the images on the, in the book are square. This, of course, is not a square. These are, you know, rectangular. So when I did the cards, some of these sides were lost. But um, it's essentially, if you're just working with the cards and you have the title and you have the reference point, it, it shouldn't be a problem. But the, some of the sides and the top cut off, but the center is, is available and you can see easily. Deep within. Dreamland. The elegant sea. Elementals. So how did I come up with these? I came up with them over over years of you know trying different things, the tarot, reading other cards, uh, through meditation, uh, through books that I've read on spirituality. So it's a combination of a lot of different things. Of course, I had a short practice. I had a not a short practice. I did a practice um, on uh, a spiritual practice that I did for a while, and so also it came. This also was part of that. Esteem self. Fear. So if there's any issues that you're dealing with, uh, the, you know, there's many things here that maybe will speak to you, that maybe will help you deal with whatever issue you're dealing with. Grateful heart. Haka. Healing sounds. Herald of Symbols. Inner Child. Inner Warmth. Joyful Spirit. Lessons. So I talk about these uh, in the book. Like lessons about is about working with metaphors, uh, getting to know yourself better, dealing with issues that you have. And metaphors are really interesting, and that's what this card's about. Liberator, living yes. So I have a lot of anecdotal information, uh, things that I've done, I've experienced. Uh, things that I've uh, experienced with other people. Uh, so it's, it's, I kind of brought it all together. This is sort of a follow-up to my meditation book, but it's much more expansive. Memory Keeper. Mindful Movement. The Moon Card. Muse. Never too late. Path to pardon. Presence. PTSD navigator. Releaser of ill will. Resilient, vi resilient victor. Restful space. Ritual keeper. Sanctuary. This one was definitely cut off where I didn't like it, so I ended up, there's a little gnome over here, so when the, the revised deck, I, I made sure the little gnome was showing, because you never know when a gnome may be talking to you. Scribe. 
I'd say importance of journaling. Journaling is really important in uh, a process of self-discovery. Sentry. When uh, what this is about is uh, well, you 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 could read about what it's about. But when I, this came up after working with AI, and then this thing came up, I was like, oh man, this is just totally the greatest picture ever. Uh, ser uh, Serenity. Star. Stillness. The sun. Surrenderer. Trauma healer. I have three cards that deal with uh, different levels of trauma because I think, you know, when you get someone with PTSD, it's very different uh, than someone who is resilient, the resilient victor or someone who's a trauma healer. There's, they serve our levels. So I kind of gave them each their own card. The first level is resilient victor. The second level is trauma healer. And the third level is PTSD. Um, is it survivor? Navigator. Navigator, yeah. Tristessa. Uplifting hands. And visionary. So there you have my 52 archetypes that are discussed at length in the book. And this is the back of the book. And thanks for watching. And I will put the uh, link to the cards when I receive, when my shop is open. Right now it's, uh, it's not open yet. Okay, thanks a lot. Have a great day.